Oh my gosh, hello. Hello testing, hello friends, family, enemies, strangers. Hi, how's it going? Happy Sunday? No, no, Friday. Oh my gosh, I never, oh, that was bad. Okay, anyway, hey friends. Hi, welcome in. Hello, Alicia, Piplup and Cookies, Caroline. How are you all? Hannah, hello, welcome in. Selin, hi, welcome in. I just got back from a treasure island, which was why I had a little two minute delay there. I was literally on the airplane um, flying back to my island. Got a lot of stuff for the build today. You know how it is, you know how it is. Never fear, Walmart bag is here. Hello, the chat VIP has made it. The MVP of Lex Play Streams is here. Hello, Walmart bag. How are you? Hello, Abby. Kayla, hi. Michael, hi. Ben, hello. Mimi, hi. Welcome in. I hope you're all having a splendid day so far. My concept for today is working on the shopping district for the island. So it's going to be in this back corner that we like started working up to back here. We've just got a lot going on. Not really. We have like nothing going on back here. So we're going to do a nook's cranny, you know? I'm thinking maybe we slap nook's cranny down right here. Have a little private beach section over here. Maybe a little, I don't know, a little drink stand here. Do you see it? Can you see the vision? We also started working on this last week and then I just didn't put anything over here yet. So we're going to like, we're going to think about this for sure. We're going to think about it. We're going to really consider doing something with this cliff. Indeed. Indeed, indeed. Also, Amelia, welcome in. I was checking Nightbot, and guess what, Amelia? You are the top chatter this month. Congratulations. You sent the most chats. Caroline, you were a close second. I work for Walmart. Yeah, Walmart bag is actually, um, actually a Walmart bag, though, so maybe get on Walmart bag's level, you know? I found Freya, but I still want Sherb. Got 50 tickets prepared. That's exciting. Look at you. I've got to figure out what the heck I'm doing. Let me put my things down here. My essential items. So I've got the storage shed. I brought everything over so I'd be prepared for today instead of having to run back and forth. I mean, I'll still have to run back and forth for flowers, but just look away at that part. You are Amelia. Yes. Lara, hello. Welcome. I've really got to get on this. I've got to get some stuff out. Let's see. We'll need a ladder, probably. I got some ladder setup kits, too, just in case we needed them today. So that's exciting. Where? Oh, vaulting pole. I need a shovel, of course. Probably an axe. Should I carry a slingshot just in case we see a balloon? I guess so. All right, and then we need some, I have been underusing the pink plumeria starts, so we're gonna use some of those today. I might go back and dig up some of the white ones and replace them with pink because I forgot I had pink ones. Or not that I had them, but I forgot I was using them. I'm eating while wearing headphones, so that sounds terrible. You should stop doing that. Let me grab, I think maybe these and these. Some of these just in case. I promise I have like a concept for today's build. Like I actually did think about what I wanted to build. But I'm still like, hmm, what am I going to do? Like there's a lot happening here. I have a lot of stuff now. Specifically, I got these orange end tables and yellow diner chairs. Because I've seen someone use that combo before and it was great. So we're going to do that. Anyway, I guess I should start mapping out where exactly I want Nook's Cranny to be. I could also, it is an option that I could build up some cliffs to put Nook's Cranny on, but then I would probably end up blocking this off. Maybe not. Let me look at this area. Oh, Ben, you're so kind. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Let me see. So we have this over here. I could extend this cliff just a little bit out. I think I will and put 
Nox Cranny up there. And then have a little drink thing. You'll see what I mean. I literally cannot explain what I'm talking about. Also, everyone say goodbye to the pineapple hat for now. We're about to enter Island Designer. Everyone say bye. Bye, pineapple hat. Oh my gosh. How sad. Okay. Also, hold on. Let me make sure this member goal is accurate. Let me... While I'm doing all this... Island Designer... I don't know if you can hear my mouse clicks and stuff, but if so, ASMR. ASMR. Purple Pixie, hello! Enjoy your lurk. I am having a good week. I hope you are too. Oh, our member goal is slightly inaccurate, but in a good way. Let me change it. We have 83. Oh my gosh, ASMR... Alrighty. That should be good now. Sorry for that little delay. Let's go ahead and start building up the cliff. I hope all of you are having a good day. Does anyone have any fun weekend plans? I'm mostly prepping for next weekend because this upcoming week, obviously Easter is coming up next weekend. It is my sibling's spring break and I always keep them for a week for their spring break. Or not for a week, but for several days like a little vacation. So I'm like planning things to do with my little siblings. If you have any ideas for distracting and entertaining children, specifically teenage children for like a week, let me know. Let me know. Thank you all for saying bye to Pineapple Hat. That's super important. Gonna hunt Sherb in a bit. Got Freya and took her in case no other good villagers, but you've got 50 tickets. Now good luck with your hunt. I hope you find Sherb. I still remember when Animal Crossing was still pretty new, so like 2020, someone posted like a fan cam sort of edit of Sherb and it was the like most satisfying edit I've ever seen. Just like the way they put it together was so good, but it, they posted it on Twitter and then they deleted their Twitter. So I've never been able to see it since. I think about that edit still to this day. Hopefully rotting in my bed. I hope you get to do that. Finishing our basement bedrooms, exciting. I think this is good, to be honest. No, no. Go ahead and tear this down. I'm working through the weekend. I'm a six day work week, really. That's a lot. That is a lot. My cousin has a birthday party tomorrow, currently taking a trip for the mountains, or in the mountains. That sounds fun. I don't know that I've, I only went to the mountains, like I live in North Carolina, so we have mountains on the Western part of the state. I have been there, I've been over to the mountains like one time and it was last year cause my dad wanted to go to watch the leaves change. So we just took like a little day trip down there. I'm a teen, here's advice, give them everything they want. Okay, so I am not rich though, and they are needy. I'm thinking give them one thing they want, ice cream. I usually take them to the movies, but I don't know that there's anything good showing. That's been like a chronic problem lately, I feel like. Never anything good at the movie theater. I might need to extend this forward a little bit more, but we're gonna go ahead and map out where Nux Cranny is gonna be. I think it's seven by four. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is this correct? No, I don't know. Let them play ACNH or pottery making or a new film. I do want to take them somewhere they haven't been. I'm thinking we could maybe go for a walk on the greenway in my area. Maybe hit an aquarium or something. The zoo, 
though, see, the problem is that they live closer to the zoo than I do. So, like, they've been more recently than I have. Okay. I could always extend this and have the incline come up here. Like, right here, have a little wooden incline. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? I could also have this just pull over here. Maybe have a little, like, waterfall coming off of the peninsula? Shut up, wait. Wait a second. I'm having thoughts. I'm thinking, lead the water this way, right? Are you following? Lead this water over here. And then have cliffs here and a side waterfall right here that, like, falls into the water. Hmm... Hmm, lots of thoughts. Lots of thoughts. Not very much doing, but lots of thinking. I also need to make sure that's correct for the shop dimensions. Let me go grab Nook's Cranny. Hi, Tom Nook. I need the entire island shop really quick just for fun. Oh my gosh, thank you, Selen. We're doing our best. We're doing our best. Lex, what theme do you think will suit the name Lily Pond? It's going to be my forever island, so we'll change the theme throughout. I think Tropicor would go well with that. I think Spring Core, but like with a focus on the pond element. It's like a water extensive Spring Core, if that makes sense. Or intensive, I mean. Good luck, Piplop. I believe in you. You've got this. Inspiration has hit, truly. Also, Matthew, how did your stream go? Did you get my email about lag fixes that I have seen? About bridges, inclines, I want layout changes. The shop. Yes, Lara, with a bridge. I would have like a little bridge extending over to connect the path on either side. My cat's, or my friend's cat just gave birth last night and we need a gender neutral name for the kitten. Mm. I don't know. Let me think about it while we get, did I? How did I mess that up? How did I, did I need money? I, I never read, bro. I'm going to assume it's a money problem. I have Egbert, he's so cute. Egbert is cute, underrated villager. Yeah, I said Tropicore for the first one, Holly. Are you moving the Able Sisters too? I was gonna make a little Able Sisters area too, but I don't know if there's gonna be room. So we'll see. I might just give them their own area later. All I can think of for names is Jean Interesting. Felix is a good cat name. I agree. I love the name Felix. I think that a really good cat name is Roni. Not to be biased. Not to be biased. I really want to name a cat something crazy like table or spatula or something. Just something super random. Yeah, I get that. I think it's funny when cats just have the weirdest random household names. Naming my next cat Goose, probably. I think Goose is such a hilarious name for a cat. I need a cat named Goose. Should have named Roni Goose. My cats are Brody or Broody and Dizzy. Cute. Food names are pretty gender neutral. And Roni's full name is Macaroni. So look at Roni. All 
our ginger kitty is named Billy. That's so cute. Hello, Sergeant Ducky. Welcome in. Also, I just assume that the SGT in your name is Sergeant, but if it's not, let me know. <laughs> let me know. I can stop calling you that. I've always loved zucchini. Imagine a cat named zucchini. Hello, Shelby. Welcome in. How are you? Did not mean to do that. Oh my gosh. Hi, Gilly Witchy. How are you today? Oh my gosh. I was right about the dimensions. Okay. I reckon this is fine. Whatever. Will it let me put an incline so close to Nook's Cranny? I don't know. I do not know. Okay, I think I might extend this out further just so I can have a tree beside Nook's Cranny. I feel like it looks really wrong and barren if it's just on a cliff edge, so we'll do that. Ciao. I didn't wait. Oh yeah, this is coming together. My kitty is Aziza. Is that how you pronounce it? Aziza? Void is a great name for a black cat, true. Okay. Let me go ahead and put sand down so I remember that I want to plant a tree here. Maybe put some plumerias down as well. I love just knocking out little areas of decor before I even move things because the stuff behind the tree kind of stresses me out. And I could have like a lantern or something here. We'll figure that out. Actually, you know what I want to do? I want to have fences back here. So I'm going to move these forward one. Yeah, and then we'll have a palm tree in front of that. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be lovely, 12 out of 10, okay. Now I could really get started on figuring this out. Let me build the cliffs first, I think. I also do want to have space still to get over the peninsula and stay on the beach. Like, I don't want to block the peninsula off, so this beach back here is private. So we've got to keep that in mind as well. But if possible, I would like it to be a two-layered cliff, so I don't know. Lots to think about here. Alright, I need to leave this empty. Let me put a custom design. Hello, Ashley. Welcome in. How are you? We're just getting started today. Right now, the concept is to build a waterfall on this side so that we can stretch some water over this path to connect to this water. And we've got Nook's Cranny up here. We're going to build probably a little like, kind of like a little island bar or like, 
I don't know how to describe it, like a little slushy shop kind of with seating over there. We'll have like a little bridge. It'll be cute. I feel like I'm being very ambitious given the small amount of space I have back here, but everyone shut up. I mean that respectfully, of course, as always. I like to hide bamboo speakers. Yes, I have done that. I think I should do it on this island. I was gonna just put a jukebox in the like little drinks area just because I feel like that makes sense naturally to have like a little jukebox out. But on the rest of the island, I do wanna incorporate some like little hidden speakers. Let's see how it goes. Also, there's Piper earlier before I started stream. She was trying to move out, by the way. So don't be fooled by her innocent appearance. She's actually the devil. For trying to move out. That was super rude. Not to be extreme. I would never. Villager singing is my Roman Empire. That's funny. Hold on. What am I? Is this gonna be too close? I don't know, but I kinda want it closer. Just by two. This is the this is the most we can extend this cliff out, to be honest, because otherwise it's gonna be too big too bulky for this area but that's okay piper how could you i know the audacity of the villagers sometimes mythical marty hello welcome in i love watching your videos for inspiration that makes me so happy i wouldn't be here without the limitless creativity of some of the people that i feature so shout out to the community as a whole for being so creative Let's go ahead and flesh this cliff out. I want to have like a double-sided waterfall. So going off the side and the front. Here we go. Oh, no Piplop. Let me check my settings here in a second. I'm thinking. If I did this right, I should still be able to fit. Yes, I'll be able to put a tree here too, which I think will help. Okay, maybe I should go dig up some trees since I'm like already kind of planning out where they're going to go. I could also have water in front here, I think, which would look cute. I'm gonna take this down. This. Yarby lunchtime. Enjoy your lunch, Abby. Okay. That seems good. And then I'll have a water over here. I 
think I'll just go ahead and cut across the path here. Oh, not there. Terraforming feels like a science, I'm not gonna lie to you. Welcome in Lazy Mint. I think that's your name. Let me know. Let me know. We are just working away currently at making some water here. Let me go ahead and extend this waterfall too. So I can see what we're working with. Also, do you guys want to hear something exciting? I am posting two videos this weekend. So there's a video coming tomorrow and a video coming on Sunday, which is unusual for me. Um, I will be posting two new games for my channel this weekend. So one is going to be a game that I filmed probably like a week ago now, to be honest. And I'm really excited to share that. And the other one is a highly requested one. It is going to be Stardew Valley. I don't feel like I've ever had a game so highly requested on my channel as Stardew Valley has been. So I'm really excited to get started with that. Make a little farm. You know how it is. The other game will just be a surprise. But I wanted to tell you guys that Stardew Valley is coming because people have definitely asked for that. And I feel like it's going to be so exciting. Is this? I think I need another space over here. Very narrow little opening here, but it's fine. It's fine. Let me go see if I can build this bridge. Ah, oh, Georgie, I'm so glad to hear that. I hope you'll enjoy the video. It should be coming on Sunday. Potentially, potentially. Is it a cozy game? Give us a hint. It just released for Steam and I think Switch like a week or two ago. So it's a new game. It is, in my opinion, kind of cozy. I feel like cozy is very subjective. So I don't like to just like say yes, because I don't know. What if you guys don't think it's cozy? Lex, is it okay if I talk about 1.6 spoilers? Okay, yeah, chat. Jabba is going to be discussing the 1.6 update for Stardew. I am giving them permission. Please don't look at Jabba's messages if you don't want to see that. Thanks, Nightbot. Look at Nightbot doing its job for once. For once. Oh, you had a thought bubble. I know. I noticed. I'm going to walk outside and it's going to be gone. It better not be Piper. I swear. I swear if it's Piper, guys, I'm gonna lose it. Okay, what bridge? I'm thinking maybe suspension for this area. 129,000 to build that. Me going through all the new releases on Switch. If one of you guessed it, I would confirm. I would confirm. It is coming tomorrow, so you'll see it very soon. Let me withdraw 130k for this bridge. And let's go see who had a thought bubble, assuming they still have it. If we go outside, no one does. Also gonna lose it. Please be Bangle. Bangle, please get out. I finally paid off all my home loans. Good job, Caroline. Exciting. Wow, see now no thought bubble. It better not have been Mitzi. Mitzi, you're my favorite, I think, on this island. You can never leave. Oh yeah, remember when I said I was gonna get trees and then I forgot to eat food? Oh, here's Bangle. She's not trying to move. I don't even care then. Bangle is my op now, I think. 
Likes the kitten's name is Tux because it's black and white. Cute. Here's Piper. She's chilling now. She's chilling now. I want Bengal so bad. Give her to me. Ava, are you in the Discord server? If so, you could at me and I can um message you if I get her to move out. I would be down to give her a new home. I don't hate her. I just don't like her. Okay, yeah, I did the perfect amount of space here. Let's imagine it. Just for giggles. Yeah, that's fine. Paleo? No, I have posted Paleo before. I did a day one video, A, eh, for Paleo, if you want to check it out. Okay. We've got the bridge figured out here. Can you believe this was just a concept like five minutes ago and now it's coming to fruition? Random question, I've been trying to get that hairstyle forever. Do you mind telling me how to get it? So this hairstyle is from Harriet on Harv's Island. I think the hairstyles correlate with which like places you've already paid for. And I'm pretty sure this one is for Leaf's place. So if you already have Leaf and you talk to Harriet, you should be able to get this hairstyle. You can only get one a day though. So if you've already paid for multiple of the little camping installations, you just have to wait for her to give you this one. Why am I going over here? I just randomly like to run through areas I've already built. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Let me get some food so I can dig up trees. So we can get started on that. And then I'm gonna, after I dig up the trees, I'm probably gonna go ahead and time travel so we can use that bridge because it's just gonna make things easier. Garden life? No, but I want that game so bad. I wish they'd like sponsor a video or something. Even if they don't, I'm probably gonna get it eventually and play it. Not gonna lie to you. That game seems so cute. What should I eat? I guess this. All right, let's go dig up some trees. Going this way when there was a way around the cliff was unhinged a little bit. That's okay. Ooh, I might also have to go Nook Mile islanding. Island, go spend some Nook Miles because I definitely need, um, whatchamacallit, some more bamboo. I guess I could also shake some of these trees for coconuts and get some um, more coconut trees planted. Currently working on a sunflower island. That sounds beautiful. What's the update? Foxy, do you mean for Stardew Valley or for something else? Go ahead and plant these things. Oh. Also, there's Blueberry. I want her to move out too. Not gonna lie to you. She is cute though. Okay, Ava, just like ping me so I don't forget. And I can start seriously trying to get her to move out. Let me see if I can talk to her. Where is Bangle? Bangle, come back. Next Animal Crossing, can we please just like be able to look at our Nook phones and call our villagers and find out where they are? Can I summon Bangle to me in the next game? Honestly, just being able to like call in chat would be cool instead of having to find them to have your daily chats. Wait, is this Bangle's house? Did she go inside? It is Bangle's house. Let's go see her. Oh, I thought Animal Crossing had an update. No, Animal Crossing has not been updated since 2021. I think it's safe to say it's never gonna be updated again. They literally released like a second um, 
like a final official guide. And I feel like that was them saying, hey, this is for sure not going to be updated again. Because why would they commission an entire new like official guide for the game after Happy Home Paradise if they were going to add more stuff? Then they just have to do it again. It's rough out here. I wish Animal Crossing had an update. Wait, how do I do that? Just at me. Just go in like AC and H chat and be like, at Lex, remember to give me Bangle. You can be as mean about it as you want to. I'll be, I'll survive. I'll survive. Switching into lurking mode. Enjoy your lurk, Alicia. I think I might have a little like pond over here with like a, a flamingo or something. It'll be a little weird since there's also water right here, but I'll separate them with a pink plumeria. And now, you know, like it's perfect. My design abilities are an enigma indeed. Okay, I did want that bush one over. Please stop, okay. Hello, Arden. How are you? Welcome in. It's going well so far. We're working on this silly little build over here. I'm leaning over to Nook's Cranny. This is like probably one of the biggest builds we've done so far. All in one, aside from the campsite, like I've been trying to figure things out and this is the area. I think it's cute. I think it's coming together. Let me go ahead and plant this coconut tree and then we'll time travel so we have the bridge. Is it going to be the new Princess Peach game? No, I have already filmed this game, so it has been out. Are you guys getting the new Princess Peach game? I was like on the fence about it. I think I'd get it if it went on sale, but I don't know if I'm willing to pay full price for it at this point. Also, Alicia was right. Everybody hydrate. I'm going to time travel forward a day here so we have our bridge and our nook's cranny. Let's go ahead and time travel. Had to pop out, but I'm back. Hello, Haley. Thank you so much. I'm glad you're enjoying the island. I'm just glad Lotus Reef is finally going, like, coming together because it was... Definitely my favorite island concept. I've always wanted to make a tropical kind of vibe, a resorty sort of island. So this is really exciting for me as well. Okay, hold on. I just changed the um ad frequency uh gilly. Ooh, and Piplup. So, sorry, I had to stretch. <laughs> that must have been a strange sound for those of you who can't see me. My bad. Oh, not rain, bro. I think not. We're time traveling forward two days now. This island makes me miss building on Dragonfly Arden. Oh my gosh. This island makes me nostalgic about everything. I think I want to see someone play the new Princess Peach game before I decide if I want it. Dang, maybe I should have gotten it. Maybe I should have pre-ordered and made a video for it. I guess I could still. I can't remember when it releases or if it's out now. Hello from London. Hello, Addy. I'm currently going through Elden Ring and Animal Crossing at the same time. That is definitely interesting. That is definitely interesting. Nikki, hi, how are you today? Welcome in. No rain, exactly. What do you think of Tears of the Kingdom? I think it's good. Um, I have barely played myself. I do own the game and I did start it, but I never got out of the like tutorial area. Never actually got to like Hyrule or whatever. Um, 
but I've seen a lot of videos of it being played and I think it's a phenomenal game. It just like hurts my brain. I can't play it if I'm in the mood for just like mindless gaming because it's so much. I don't know. The like putting things together just really stressed me out. Still think it's a phenomenal game though. I think they did just a great job with Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. Common Nintendo W. Or would a Nintendo W be rare? I'm not sure. It's currently raining here in Florida. It is kind of cloudy where I am. Not raining, but not, not sunny. It's not vibrant outside. I'm making a community center on my fall island based on Stardew. That sounds cute, Stitch. For those of you just popping in, I'm actually going to be releasing a Stardew Valley video this weekend, most likely. I'm like really excited about it, given the new update and all. Alright, we have our little bridge now. Let me get back into Island Designer and we can start figuring this out. I love Tears of the Kingdom. It's genuinely my favorite recent game. It is very good. Clementine Crossing, hello, welcome in. We are just working on this area. We built this river up, put this bridge in, made these waterfalls, and moved Nook's Cranny over here. That is pretty much what we've done so far. It's been a little bit of terraforming, a lot bit of thinking. Okay, now I've just got to figure out things to put over here. I guess I could just put some more flowers. I need to dig up some flowers. Let me grab some. I got a lot of new items for today's build, so I need you guys to like bully me into using them. I'm just like so terrified of using the things that I've acquired, like using items. I always veer towards just using plants for my decor. I'm currently making a Taylor Swift themed island. How is it Taylor Swift themed? Is it, oh, I didn't mean to pick that. Is it like uh, themed around her albums? Like, do you have different areas based on her albums? Get another one of these. Do I have, I do have green mums. Let's grab some of those. Not expecting it to be like today, just whenever. I got you, Ava, I got you. I might try to move her out today just because I keep talking about it every stream and then not doing it. Also because I'm scared I'll forget and just like let her move out and then I would feel terrible. Even if you were like, no, it's okay. I'd be like, nah, I'm the devil for that, bro. All right, we've got some flowers. Let's run over. Oh my gosh, look at Nightbot doing its job. I love you, Nightbot. Wow. Also, how did you all celebrate Nintendo? I mean, not Nintendo. Oh my gosh. How did you celebrate Animal Crossing's anniversary this week? March 20th was Animal Crossing's fourth birthday, if you didn't already know. Our little game is four years old. Did you play? Did you talk to your villagers? Be honest. Mosh, saucy meatball. Did I see you? Did I say hello? Hi, saucy meatball. Not a big fan of Taylor Swift. I think her music is great. I listen to it all the time. It helps me fall asleep at night. A lot of her like slower songs. I feel like she gets a lot of hate for her pop songs that go like super viral, like Look What You Made Me Do. I hate that song. I cannot stand that song. Some of her quieter stuff, the things that have like actual non poppy, like heartfelt lyrics, I think are good. I'll die on that hill. I will die on that hill. Actually, let me... I'm gonna put this back.
have a little irregular pond here. It's looking a little too put together for my taste. Okay. Yeah, that's acceptable. We also do... Oh, this cliff is so obnoxious. Let me put away my water terraforming. What can we see as we're walking over? Okay, you can see most of it. This will be fine. All right. Having a lot of thoughts. Let me put a bush here. Maybe a custom design here just to fill in the space. I remember watching the teaser trailers for ACNH. I literally didn't see anything about it. I just got it right after release. So I feel like I really escaped the like anticipation there. Like I didn't have to wait for Animal Crossing. I didn't want it until it was already out. But this next game, when the next game comes out, I'm going to be fiending for it. I'm going to be miserable. Not going to lie to you. Let me put a custom design here because I feel like I can't put it. Oh, can I not put a custom design there, bro? Let me try with this. My tool. I remember freaking out over the announcement of the 2.0 update. I do remember that. That was incredible. One of the like best times of my life. Like I'm not even, I'm not saying that ironically. Like I mean it. It was one of the most exciting periods of my life. That news, I think, hit everyone in the community like a truck. I refuse to believe that the 2.0 update was last year. Or, er, wait. <laughs> it wasn't. I refuse to believe that the 2.0 update was three years ago. It feels like last year. It does not feel like it's been that long, but I do feel, I do feel the agony that has been no update. So I do believe it. I do believe it. What sort of pathway do I want to go around here? I'm thinking of having a this. And then for this, I'd have like Chat, is this ugly? Be honest. Oh, did not mean to do that. I remember the 2.0 update coming out early. Oh yeah. When I tell you I stayed up that night until like 2 a.m. playing, I streamed immediately. It dropped and me and all my custom, not custom, content creator friends were online. I'm sorry, Lex, I can't fully watch your stream. My cat is politely requesting my attention. I respect that. I respect that. Tell your cat I said hello. What is your cat's name? I'll tell them hello right now. Three years ago, yeah. Oh, I did let a balloon. I got my slingshot today and everything, bro, and I still let that balloon go. Oops. Oops. What's the plan for the area? I want this area to be a little, um, what is it called? You know. A, like, not a tea shop. A little area for people to come and sit and dine, though. I'm thinking I'm gonna need to get like some plant partitions maybe to kind of spice this area up because I'm used to having a lot of plant life and trees, but I didn't have room behind this area for trees, which I would have liked. 
Maybe I could work them in somehow. Food court, lounge area, patio, cafe. Are you guys just trying to inspire me? Tiki bar? Yeah, similar to a tiki bar, I guess. <clears throat> Forgot to say lurking because I'm villager hunting, sure, but lurking, I got you, Piplup. I remember you were hunting. I hope it's going super well so far. Hold on, what's going on in front? I hate when the bushes line up exactly, but I definitely want a bush here, so we're just gonna have to make that sacrifice, I guess. And then I'll have some kind of item here in front of it so that it's not the same as across the way. Let me get something here. That's cute, bro. Let me put down a little... Oh my gosh, someone commented on my video the other day. If you have Twitter, you've already seen this because I talked about it. But someone commented that I say bro too much and so they have to unfollow. If my saying bro offends you, I'm so sorry. I did not know that people hated that term. It wasn't like a gender thing for them. It was like a their daughter calls them bro and it makes them feel disrespected. I was like, oh... I, feel, I call my mom bro and she calls me bro. It's fine. <clears throat> Amber, hello. How are you? Help me get motivation to work on my island. Bestie, look at what we've created so far today. Look at the terraforming. Look at the terraforming. I've got like a tree all the way up there, bro. Then I've got this bridge we set up. I've got to put an incline in here for Nook's Cranny. Dude, be, be motivated by my own whatchamacallit, my own productivity. I'm thinking, okay, the more I think about it, the more this would be nice to have as like a little, what should I put back here actually? I want there to be access to it. So I can't have anything like directly in front of it. So I guess I'll put the, I was thinking like an Azumaya gazebo. Have you all seen those in use for like little diners and stuff? Let me try to set it up. Let me try to set it up. Bro, brah. Thank you, Mori, for contributing to the bro dialogue. Let's see here. I guess I could also use bamboo partitions maybe if I need to, but this is the gazebo, I mean, and then I need some counter tables. Some of these bad boys. I don't know if these are the right color for what I want. Maybe one of these. Oh, my pockets are full. Let me like try to set this up, right? Okay. Gazebo? Is this all the way back? Ooh, I can put it back a half space. Okay, hold on. I'm having thoughts. Thoughts manifesting. It needs to turn this way, first of all. Yeah. I just feel like there should be room for stuff behind it, though. So maybe I need to put it over here. Okay, take two. It's as far over that way as it can go. And I could put maybe a tree back here. Could I place a tree right beside the rock? We're gonna try. Not feeling super hopeful about it. <gasps> oh my gosh. This just changed the vibe of my life. And then we still are able to get onto the rock. This is great. I posted cat tax in Discord. Thank you so much, Rain Games. I cannot wait to see your cat. We're gonna go ahead and do, not this, this. Is this the right version of this table that I want? I think so. Oh, not there, but okay. Should I, let me go see what versions of this table exist. 
Oh, so let me put some stuff away so I can grab the other counter tables. Get a partition of sorts for behind it. Yeah, I was thinking about putting one of the bamboo partitions. We're gonna go ahead and... I don't think I'll need glowing moss or any more vines. So we're gonna put those away. This... I don't think I'll need these. Counter table, coconut. Go ahead and put all those away and let me grab out all my counter tables and then we're gonna go talk to Cyrus. Are you making a bar? The way you capitalize bar makes me nervous. No? I'm making little cutes cafe. Tropical cafe. Is this? Let me see. Oh, I should have gotten a bamboo partition out. Let me see what it looks like with a bamboo partition. Hello, Tabitha. Welcome in. Sorry, I'm late. I've been cleaning and prepping for the weekend. I hope it was productive. We are just hanging out. Don't worry about it. There's also a plant partition, so we'll try that too. But here is... I think I need to be back one more. Okay. Here is the bamboo partition, if I can find it. Yeah, I like that. And then I could have like the plant partition maybe here. No, stop. Oh my gosh. There we go, okay. Yeah, that's cute. Okay, let me go see about these counter tables. No offense for bars, I work in a bar. Yeah, okay. I thought you were asking like family friendly Lex play. Are you making a bar right now? Hello, LPS Little Gaming. What should I have for my dinner? What are your options, Betty? <laughs> okay, Piplop, have a good day. Hope you can come back soon. We're just running to Harv's Island really quick. I have like 80% of the layout of my island figured out, but the decorating is a different beast entirely. It depends for me on each island I do. So for this island, layout has been more difficult, I think, than decorating so far. Over 21 Lex mentioning alcohol, unacceptable. <laughs> Who is the family-friendly Fortnite creator? Um, oh my gosh, what is his name? Never back down, never what? That guy. Nick A30. Nick A30. That's who I think of when I think family friendly. It doesn't matter what I'm talking about. Alright, let's... Oh, this is... Look at me having this whole... Oh, I could still get a hairstyle. Let me see what Harriet is offering today. Can I sit down, bro? Okay. Hello, I am new to Animal Crossing and need some good ideas on themes to match the name of my island. Okay, hit us, Stephanie. What's your island name? I would love to help you brainstorm. Is Walmart bag here? Walmart bag is here! Currently, Kato is the family-friendly Fortnite creator. True. Console Kato is, in fact. Okay, this is cute. I'm Aaron Yeager. We're not going to keep it, but I do like this hairstyle. Hello, Pineapple Hat. True. Pineapple Hat is back. <clears throat> I'm glad Walmart Bag knew who I was talking about. Nick A30. Never back down. Never give up. Ava, welcome back. We were just talking to Harriet, getting a new hairstyle unlocked. Now I need to go talk to Cyrus about customizing 14 counter tables. 
I'm glad this is an option, but gosh, they could have made it easier and faster. Lucy is back for more pets. Aww. Say hi to Newt, Le Lex. He's going through cat puberty. Hello. <laughs> Newt, are you okay? Is he named after the Maze Runner character? Please say yes. Oh, imagine me immediately going out of the menu. Okay, guys, I'm not gonna lie. I think I had the right counter in the first place. I'll change two of them to white wood just in case I want that more. I'm struggling with custom codes right now. New Island is kid core and there's almost too many options. I feel that. I feel like every time I see a kid core island, there are so many adorable little island. I mean, not island, little custom designs that are like potential for use. Lex, my brother named him Newt because of Maze Runner. Heck yeah, bro. Heck yeah. I love that character. Newt was my favorite character in that series. I love that for us. My literal only hope for the next Animal Crossing is that they make doing things in bulk easier. Me too. If they release this game again, but with the ability to bulk buy, bulk custom design, bulk, etc. Sold. $60 straight to Nintendo. Who knows? Maybe the next game will be $70 given inflation. Don't you guys love our, our societies? The inflation that's happening? That look with no eyebrows is mildly unsettling. Keelan. <laughs> that's wild. Also, hello. We hit 200 viewers. Hi, everyone. I hope you're enjoying watching me custom design things. I am, in fact, about to get back to the building. How can I shorten the name Meriwether? It's too long. Have you considered... Moether? Have you considered just weather? I'm potentially the least helpful person for this, actually. My brain doesn't work when I'm trying to design. All I can think is design things. Okay, this is the white counter table. Oh wait, actually I might prefer this. Versus the yellow, let's see the yellow again. Yeah, honestly the yellow is offensive to me. Now get out of here. Okay, but now I might have to go back and customize more to white. Oh my gosh. Wait, did I only change one? Hello? Not bad, this. There we go. Okay. All right. And then I can move this over. So there's no room to, like, put anything behind it. I guess I could put another... I could put a bamboo partition here. Let me see if I can get one to fit. Like the stream or Walmart bag will come for you. This is from Walmart bag, not me, but it is true. So, you know, like the stream, whatever. Did you just say yellow was offensive? No, just the yellow counter table in that position was offensive. Yellow is fine. It is in fact being used on my island. Don't worry. I would never, I would never crap on an entire color. Oh my gosh, family friendly Lex Play said the word crap. Yeah, and then I could get another one for this side. It is a little cramped here. Hmm. Whatever. You know, I guess I could also... What if I... Instead of having two counter tables here... What if I made it one? Put a plant here. I need pathway for this area. Do I even have any vertical pathways? No, I have exclusively sideways pathing. Very cute, very cute. I'm so prepared for the world. We'll figure that out later, okay. And then I could have a counter. Oh, maybe I do prefer the two counter tables. 
No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. Sorry, you're gonna have to bear with me because I am silly goosing right now. Do I have orange chairs and stuff? Do I have the diner tables? I do, okay. I'm thinking we'll need something in the back here. Gabriel, welcome in. Thank you for subscribing. Let me move this down here. Okay. Little diner chair situation. Actually, do I want this? I want this further over. Okay. One, two. One, two. And we'll have some more diner chairs here. What an adventure this is becoming. I don't want them to line up exactly, by the way. That's intentional. I guess I can push it one further. Further! Can I speak English? Diner chair. Okay, then the offset is a little more obvious if I have them one more. 100 likes! Thank you so much for liking the stream. Okay, yeah. I'm thinking this is good. I'm thinking this is a good vibe. Then I just need ideas for this beach rock. What are we gonna put back here? I feel like I need to make it... I need to put custom designs down because the gray kind of throws off the happiness of this area. No offense to gray. You think I could put a tree here? Oh, I don't have my island designer. We still have pineapple hat for a moment. Why doesn't mobile YouTube let me at people? It is obnoxious. Lex, what's the best way to get a villager to move out? Typically, if you... Okay, if you have an amiibo card, that's the number one best way. But assuming you don't. Honestly, just time traveling. Nope, we cannot place. Oh, wait. Somebody said that they had to dig a hole. I'll see if that works. I don't think it's going to, but... Nope. Okay. Unlucky. I think it's because the water is too close here. We tried, we failed, we must persevere. I wonder... I could absolutely put a tree here. I just feel like trees really add to the vibes, you know? They just make everything look nicer. Yeah, see, that's good. Okay. What do I want? I definitely need some kind of, like... I want another counter back here, actually. And then we still have full access to the beach here, so that's fine. But this will give us... Yeah, okay, I need to get my slushy machine out. <laughs> Rip pineapple hat. It'll be back, it'll be back. There's a method with amiibo cards. Yeah, if you have amiibo cards, after you, it takes three in-game days to convince someone to move in. But once you do convince them, you can choose who moves out. Like, you get to make that decision. So pros and cons, pros and cons. Wait, I didn't even find the slushy machine. Wait a second. 
Wait a second. Slushy machine? Wherefore art thou, Romeo? Did I dream that I got a slushy machine? Please say no. <laughs> Guys, did I mess up? Okay, hold on. What's something I got today? I think I got this today. Time. Oh no, the drink machine stands on its own. Nice, okay. So theoretically, I don't even need that counter table. What the? No, I'm gonna put the slushy machine behind it actually. And then we'll have, I wish there was like, do I have an empty glass? I wonder, I do want to put a festival lamp here. Not the infused water dispenser, festival lamp. And then I'm going to put the magazine there and it's going to act like a menu. So you go up and there's the menu for this place. Then we'll have some kind of, I guess, coconut juice we'll place right here. And an infused water dispenser. See, that's cute. This place is shaping up. This place is shaping up. Then we have some pear jelly to place here. And I guess I need one more drink. So I want one drink. I got a meal out, but I think I'm going to replace it with a drink. Okay. Okay, yeah, thank you all. Thank you all for helping me figure out the drink machine thing. I didn't I thought when I saw it in pictures, I thought it was sitting on counters. Like, I thought it was just a miscellaneous item. So that really threw me off. I could have a little surfboard area in the back, I think, maybe. Let me get some Chef Lara's. Let me get one of these bad boys. Guys, I really like how this is turning out. What the heck? Place, and then we're gonna turn this tail. Oh no, that's good. That's cute. Shut up. Respectfully as always. Okay. Chef Lara. Yes. Yes. That is essential. Let me get a little counter chair, actually. Counter chair, and then... I think I want to have it, like, to... Oh, I wonder if it'll fit, though. Will I still be able to, like, after I place that, will I still be able to walk by this bush? Like a kachow. I guess I could put it over here. Young man. Okay, no, the counter chair is throwing off the vibes. Throwing things off. I think I need to get something to drop here, though. For my own mental health, per se. What do I want to drop? I don't know. Hmm. I could swap the bush for a flower. Also, Vero, hello, welcome in. This is so difficult, y'all. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me 
I think I am just gonna put a flower over here because I do have so many items everywhere else. It'd be nice to have a little breath of fresh air over here. Okay, I don't like the pink though. I'll do green. Yeah. Okay. I'm having thoughts. The entrance is still my favorite part of my island. Cute. This is rapidly becoming my favorite part. What is happening over here? We've got a lot going on. I still don't know what to put on the beach rock. Because I kind of want it to like thematically align. So I don't want to just put random stuff back here. I guess I could go ahead and put some custom designs down. If I put another chef lair over here. Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? Should I push this one out? Let me see how it looks from the front, actually. Yeah, heck yeah, bro. You can put them on rocks? Do you mean custom designs? Absolutely you can. I can fully connect it though. I didn't realize it would go over that like layer of grass too. Nice. I get the right design going here. Cheflera is the number one potted island, true? I mean, island, what? How do I read that so wrong? Potted plant, question mark? Ooh, with more of a relaxed feel. With couches, yes. Mori, you're so right, we're gonna do that, okay. Let me find some custom designs, customization kits, and then we'll get some, this could come in handy. Let me find, yes, these couches. One of these, maybe a cushion. Just kind of see what happens there. Maybe some more festival lamps. Maybe one of these bad boys. Ooh, I got specific tables actually. In case I wanted to use tables in this build. So I could use this. Maybe one of these. Okay, let me customize some stuff here. See what we're feeling. You can custom pattern on rocks. I can't believe you guys didn't know this. Yes, you can. How did you get those custom designs? I put them in the um in the description. You should be able to find the Pinterest board with all my custom designs if you'd like to use any of them. I also wanted to get some potted plants really quick. Maybe one of these just in case. One of these. <gasps> one of these maybe. I'm gonna run out of space in my pockets with no plants. Okay. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. Moroccan couch could be cute. It could, but I don't think I have any of those. I think the log couch is going to be good, though. I'm not going to lie. 
cushion, pile, log, extra long sofa. The names of some of the items in this game are kind of unhinged. Like, why did they name it that? These tiles could be good, but I'm thinking, yes, this. Let me put some stuff away that I don't actually need so I can grab some plants out. I don't think I'm going to need this. Maybe, actually. I'm going to get rid of the counter tables. Why did I get all these counter tables out? There's literally no way I was going to use all of these. I don't think I'm going to use the ironwood. Okay, that's good for now. Let me go ahead. I'm thinking... Oh, I don't know if there's room in the back. No, I really want to, though. Okay, let me try. Because I'm thinking of doing... Bamboo partition back here. And then... Plain party lights arch... Did I even? Yeah, okay, I did. Oh my gosh, it fits. I'm gonna lose it again. That looks cute as heck, bro. That is cutie patootie energy. Let me grab some plants now. I'm back. What did I miss? We are just decorating. I am tooting my own horn about my stylistic choices. You know, the usual, the usual. Nothing wild. Okay, I'm gonna put a plant over here. Cacao tree. We're gonna push her forward a bit and turn her. Yes. Then we're gonna put this couch down. Where is my couch? Cacao. Oh, I didn't customize my log, or not my log, my cushions. I really do be saying some whack stuff. What do I mean? I haven't customized my log. <laughs> okay, whatever. Whatever, Lex. I could do a little bit of different style with this, I think, but I kind of want to... Should I just match the couch? Switch it up a little with this? I'll try this one for now. Never thought to layer those two items. I didn't either. This, this is what happens when you're just building for fun. Things just happen to you. This cushion, I'm going to make the same pattern as the couch. Because that just makes sense, I think. I got Cephalobot. Isn't the robot rare? I don't think they're rare. There are just so few of them that you don't see them as often. But I think they're just as common as any of the other villagers, just like on an individual basis. And then we're gonna go ahead and hit this rattan low table. Where did I put it? We'll have a little western style meal. And a switch light. Like, guys, say psych right now. This is adorable, bro. Why do I like this beach rock design more than I like anything else on my island, actually? Could also hit a little festival lamp right here. Like, bro. Stop. I love it here. I wonder if I could fit a green leaf pile just for color back here. Perhaps not. Oh, perhaps yes. Oh my gosh, okay. And that's that, folks. 
I think I do want to drop like a little green mum. So I'm going to pick one of... No, I'm going to pick one of the ones that's not in the build. Just in case I don't time travel enough. Thank you all. I'm so glad you like it too. I'm like shocking myself with the fact that I like this stuff. Shocked that I like my own build. Let me pick one of these and a pink mum and see what I like better. Imagine picking flowers on purpose. First time for everything. Where was I going to put that? Wait, oh, I was going to put it here. Yeah, that's cute. And I could drop the pink mom somewhere just for fun. Dropping little flowers just for the vibes, you know? I'm thinking I could have a little like picnic space over here too if I wanted to. Not sure what I'm gonna do in this area yet, but this area is, I think, complete. I could add a little something just dropped on the ground somewhere around here. But I'm not sure what I'd want to do there yet. This is taking me out, bro. Oh my gosh. Lex for real performing at 100% today. You know what I did? I slept last night, bro. That's how I'm performing better. That's how I'm having more creative thoughts because I actually slept. Crazy how that works. Let me run and get an incline to put in front of Nook's cranny and then we can get started on this. I'm so glad you're all enjoying so far. I'm actually really happy with it today. Sorry, I've been lurking. Nico demands my attention. Nico is in an IRL pet or Nico is in, oh, excuse me, the monkey in Happy Home Paradise. Imagine sleeping. Yeah, it could not be me most days, but no, I went to bed at like 1 a.m. That's really early for me. I typically go to bed at like sometime between 3 and 5 a.m. If Lotus Reef isn't five stars when you finish it, I'm gonna cry. Um, so Caroline, I need us to just sit for a second and think, when has Lex ever had a five star island at completion? I don't know if I ever have. I always have too many trees. It is absolutely gonna be maximum four stars, maybe even four, I mean three. Got a 100% on my duo lesson. Heck yeah, Ava. Good job. Okay. So I could do either the log or the white plank. So far, I've been using log and I tend to try to match all my ramps. But I could also do the white plank for a little bit of difference. I don't know. I don't know. Log or white ramp. It's five stars in our hearts, Lex. Thank you. Thank you very much. Also, there are 200 viewers right now. Could we get to 150 likes? We're only 21 away. Por favor, please. Uh, all of you are saying white plank okay i'll do white plank for you guys for you guys i literally chose that as i was seeing all the messages come in saying white plank also chat delay is kind of going crazy today so i'm really sorry if you guys said white plank like five minutes ago and i'm only now reading it to you kk ballad hung on the wall fits this so much kk ballad i need to look that up so i can see the cover my island is full of cats that's goals, Vintage Kawaii. Also, hello, I saw that you just woken up. Welcome to the waking world. Thank you for joining us. <gasps> We're at 137 likes, only 13 to go. Is everyone ready for the eclipse next month? One of my friends is driving down to Texas from North Carolina to see the eclipse. Or maybe, wait, I can't remember if it was California or Texas. I can't remember if he said San Antonio or San Diego somewhere 
Okay. Look at Blue Bear in her little dress, though. I want her to move out, but she's so cute right now. How's my bestie, Peach? She's so cute. Okay, maybe I won't let her move out. Look at her. You could also grab one and go imagine it at the cliff, and then if you don't like it, give it back to Tom Nook. You're so right. It is not the end of the world if I don't love it. Let's imagine it, and I will take a second so that the stream can catch up for you guys. What are we thinking? Is this a good spot? Lucky to be in Texas, for real. I do be out here in North Carolina. I'll see a partial eclipse, maybe. I don't know how this one's gonna work. Will we have totality of the eclipse here? Oh, we will have totality of the eclipse. My kids' therapy is throwing an event for them. That's cute. I need to get a therapist, for real. I'm just out of range for the eclipse. That's unfortunate. Mori, are you gonna drive to see it? We live like an hour away from where it can be seen in Ohio. Ooh, Ari, are you gonna go? Okay, everyone loves it, so we are gonna go with this. Is it a total eclipse? It is gonna be a total eclipse in certain areas, yeah. Oh, I forgot to get bells, no. I think it's gonna be 128, so I'll get 130. Oh gosh, just stop. I'll just go ahead and donate that much. I'm trying to go to Texas for it, but flights are wild right now. <sighs> I bet. I wish I could have gone. I, I have never seen it that I know of, that I remember. I've never seen a total eclipse. I was at UNC Chapel Hill during the eclipse that happened in like 2017 or whenever it was. The one where like Donald Trump became a meme because he looked directly at the sun or whatever. I saw that one at UNC and it wasn't a total eclipse, but it was like four fifths. So like all the shadows that day were super like weird. They were like crescent moons. So it was interesting. It was interesting. Oh yeah, we're three likes away from 150. If anyone just feels like dropping a like, no pressure. This is a low pressure situation. Will you play the song Total Eclipse of the Heart? You know, I don't want to get a copyright strike, so no, but that is a great idea. I feel so lucky because I live in the path of totality and have a big field behind my apartment. That is so lucky, Keelan. Okay, Joy, hello. Thank you for the super chat. Much appreciated, bestie. It's either one thousand dollars, one thousand like you mean that is dollars, right? When you say one k plus, you mean dollars. That's intense. Or a ten-hour layover. I once had. I think my longest layover ever was eight hours. That was like low-key miserable. I'm not gonna lie to you. So ten hours would be even worse. I guess if you were like with your family, that would be better. I was alone. I saw that total eclipse. It was like 2017, 2018. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 150. Heck yeah. Look at us. Maybe we'll hit 200 this stream again. That was like bonkers to me. I'm gonna go ahead and put a little flower down here. You know the vibes. This is going to be a pink bush, so I figured I'd put an orange flower to kind of balance things out. Oh, no, I kind of want... I kind of want a paper lantern specifically here, like in the middle. I think I'm going to have to build out this cliff. Okay, let me go ahead and put a custom design down for funsies. I don't know what to put back here, bro. It's always the little single spaces that I can't figure out. Let me build up this cliff and get a paper lantern. I'll tear it back down when I'm done. I just need this for a second. Oh, not water. Oops. Tato wave, hello. Hello. 
Come to Texas so Texans can meet you. First of all, I'm shy. Second of all, I don't know. Can you open your gates? I want to visit your island. So that is not, in fact, something I'm going to do. But thank you for asking. Very politely. You can visit the dream address. I update the dream address at the end of every stream so that people can go and visit the new builds. So that's a little exciting thing we're doing. What was I getting out of here? Oh my gosh, these are perfect. I'll use one of these and then paper lantern. That's what I was looking for. Okay. Do I have a paper lantern? Yes, I do. Oh my gosh, I forgot to put the jukebox. Let me see if I can fit that somewhere too. I also have these random pillars. Should I try to make that work? Maybe. Let's see what's happening. I don't know anywhere that I could put a jukebox, except for like literally right here in the way. Okay, can you... Nah, that's throwing off the whole vibe, I hate it, okay. RIP my jukebox ideas. I wish the jukebox could be, um, whatchamacallit, customized a bit. Let me find- ooh, I wonder what this would look like here. Ugly, okay. Great. Grass standy, and then we're gonna add a little paper lantern here. And then I can tear this cliff down. Okay, I didn't mean that one, but okay. All right. Hey, Joy, thank you so much for becoming a member. Welcome. I hope you enjoy your perks. Okay, there we go. That's cute, bro. This little corner is so cute. Okay. And then I can put my little vine back. I'm thinking have a little flower here. And then I just need some pathing. Did I already? Yes, I paid that. Okay, I'm gonna time travel one day so that I can actually build because he is in the way, the little gyroid. And I'm also gonna set my date back a little bit or my time, I mean, to one instead of three. Excellent. Are you able to do a quick tour of what you had done so far? Had to leave for a medical thing, sorry. Yes, I can. I bought Amiibo the other day and I got horrific ones like Barreled, Kurt, and Beardo. What do you mean? Those are great. Oh, wait, where did Stephanie go? Stephanie! Did you tell us your island name so we could think of themes? I must have missed that if you did. Did you see that the same day as the eclipse, the day of the eclipse is the same day as the day of the three plagues? I don't know what that means, but that sounds ominous and possibly religious. Let me take my, my sip of my drink here. Hold on. I try to sip so quietly in case my mic picks it up and someone in chat has misophonia. I'm thinking of you. I am thinking of you, my misophonia followers. <laughs> we are nine likes away from 175, which would be insane. Insane number of likes. 
Why can't they do bunny day on actual Easter day? As I hate the bunny day event with the Easter eggs in the trees and rocks. Is it not on Easter day? When is it? It's from the Bible with Moses. I didn't know that was a specific day. That we could like mark in our calendars. I think Kurt is my birthday twin, ew. Oh my gosh. Whoever, whichever, there are multiple Stephanies in chat. One of you, it was definitely someone named Stephanie who was like, hey, I need some island theme ideas based on my island name. And then I missed the island name. Okay, let's run over here. Okay, the white plank is cute. I don't know if I'm convinced that it's cuter than the log would have been, like if it matches better. Just because Nook's Cranny's like base is brown. I do like it though. It is beachy, which is what we want. As someone with misophonia, I respect the effort. Okay, I'm so glad. Hold on. What am I gonna do in front of here? That was me, it's Dreamy Cove. You know, you could do like a dream core sort of thing. A lot of, uh, what is it called? Um, I'm gonna, why can I not think today? Like pinks and purples kind of matching the vibes of like Luna's area when you go to dream. I feel like that could be cute and really um, unique. Could also just have like absurd sort of things going on like you would find in a dream. Okay, there we go. I don't know what I want here. In this little spot. I think I will go ahead and get the island designer back out. I was having a hard time thinking of streams or themes last stream. I love that you're both Stephanie. We're just struggling together. It is what it is. You could also go more with the cove side, um, other Stephanie, and think along the lines of like, hold on, let me place this so I can think. Thinking along the lines of beachy stuff. I feel like there's a lot of potential with that name, to be honest. Do I, I don't wanna be able to walk over here, I don't think. So we are going, ooh, now I kinda want the hedges. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna plant pink here and then, what am I thinking here? Maybe white plumeria start. Pink lily. Pink plumeria here. I'm just thinking out loud here as I go. Could definitely add some more items. I wonder if there's room for a tree here. I think this specific cliff is gonna make it where we can't plant a tree. That's obnoxious. I love trying it anyway, just so I'm disappointed. I wonder if this could look cute one more further down. You know, I don't think it makes that much of a difference. So I'm gonna do it so that I can add a tree. Yep, worth. Then. I want to have hedges. Let me go grab the hedges so I don't lose track of that idea. You should do grandma core after this island. I already did like a mom core theme. My fall island lost falls. I really tried to keep in mind like a mom kind of vibe, a cozy mom aesthetic. I'm not a mother, but I tried my best. 
I'm also gonna get these just in case I need them. Let me run back over here. Honestly, I feel like filler areas like this are some of the hardest to decorate. I mean, go ahead and uh, maybe I'll do like one more flower over here. I'll do a little green mum over here. Maybe some more custom designs. Yeah, no, the filler areas are harder for me than like big areas of decor just because I don't know for sure what I'm going to like. Okay, I need to do the hedge first. If I wanna layer some things here. So hedges, and then I wanna have a little log fence here. And then because I put hedges there, I can bring them around this way. W planning. have it like that yeah I think I will let me put a custom design down for some flavor it would be fun if there was a mini movie or something for this game there is an Animal Crossing animated movie I haven't seen it but it does exist I've seen clips from it I feel like it had really unexpected villagers like it had random villagers I wouldn't have expected them to put in the movie so that's always been interesting to me what did I want to put here have literally just this one spot let me go look in my my items here lunch went by way too fast gotta go back to work now well thank you for hanging out with me matthew i hope you have a brilliant rest of the day at work and aiden hello welcome in we are in the middle of decorating at the moment just trying to figure some stuff out oh i could put vines somewhere as filler I also need to figure out what I'm going to put around Nook's Cranny. That is definitely something to think about. Some log stakes could come in handy. Maybe a green leaf pile somewhere. Let me see what I can do with this. I'm thinking for Nook's Cranny, I want to have some surfboards and fishing rods. Okay, let's see what I can do with these items. First of all, I just want to put some log stakes, I think, here. Yeah, okay, that's cute. Log stakes there. I don't know what I'm doing over here yet, so we're just going to leave this bare for now. There's going to be like plenty of time later for that. And then the peninsula, I don't have a for sure concept for yet. So we're just going to see what happens. Probably just a little lounge area for this. Because I don't have a ton of space at the end of my peninsula. The most important part was just having room for a little waterfall here. And we achieved that. I definitely want to have some kind of path though leading over here. So that you realize you can access the beach and the peninsula. So that's going to be important. I saw an Animal Crossing movie that a YouTuber made. Was it Densley, Amelia? The one with the masked character? If so, I saw that one too and I thought it was great. Piplup, hello! Bye! I think I'm gonna leave Blue Bear. Hope I find Sherb. Good idea. I hope you find Sherb too. Okay. I also don't know what I'm gonna put on this cliff. This cliff is just like behind the campsite. Actually, let's take a look at the map and see how it's looking so far. Now that we've got like other stuff happening on the map. <laughs> Haven't looked at the map today. This is also a good example. I mean, a good, not example, a good opportunity to see the dream address if you'd like to visit. I haven't updated it today, so it doesn't have this nook's cranny and all of that yet. We'll do that at the end of stream. But this is what we've got going on. The island is really shaping up, guys. Bye, Haley. I hope you have a lovely rest of your day. Barathrum, the spirit breaker, welcome in. 
Citrus is stuck at three stars. That is such a cute name though, Caroline. You've gotta keep you gotta keep persevering with that island. But yeah, I'm really happy with this map so far. I think it looks great. The top right corner that we've worked on. I've also randomly worked on the entrance, so like there's something near the airport. It's going well so far, okay. Let's get back to it here. What items did I grab again? Surfboards, yeah, okay. I don't really have the like space to do much more than put some custom designs here. I wish I had one more row of space between Nook's Cranny and the bridge. I mean, the incline. Because then I could add plants. As it is, we're just kind of vibing. I guess I can do a flower here. I can do a little surfboards. I want a white surfboard, please. Yeah. I want to put over here either so there's surfboards here I could display something on this I don't know that I have anything right now that I could set on it I don't like that okay I don't really need the like ability to sell things here and if I needed to I could just pick this up so I am gonna drop that kind of hope for the best here I wonder if I could get a bamboo partition okay it does want to land right here and I don't think you can push it when it's this close to a cliff please bro let me try to place it right here I'm gonna lose it. Actually, actually, let me pull these forward and put a bamboo partition behind. And then I can put the Sheffalera, the little fishing rod stand. Yeah, that's a vibe. I do like that. I wonder if this would look better. No, because then it would look like the fishing rod stand was like on. I'm gonna do just the plain blocks right in front. Hello, Ani! Welcome in! We're at the confusing part of the build where you have to decorate. Okay, I like this. That's good. Fully accessible to this bridge. I mean, incline. We got this bridge. Oh yeah, someone asked if I could go through everything I've built so far. So we're just gonna start at this upper corner. 
So this is not decorated. We come off the beach. We have this little beach side relaxing, not bar necessarily, but like a little drink area. This lovely area on the rocks that I'm super proud of. I think this is so cute and it is accessible. You can come over here and sit down. Love the layered bamboo partition and lights back there. And you come up this way. Hold on, Ronald has jumped on the desk. Roni, that is not allowed. Thank you. Thank you. Good boy. Come over here and we've got Nook's Cranny. This is the area in progress right now that we're working on. Then you- oh my gosh, Ronald, get off of my desk. Thank you. No. Bad boy. Come down here where Bengal is walking around. We have- oh, thank you for watering that. What the heck? We built up this cliff with some trees on top. Well, a tree. That was just so I could have water, so I could have a bridge there. Come up here. This is right behind resident services. Roni, you and I are about to 1v1. Get off of my desk, my son. Thank you. Thank you. So this area is right behind resident services. It's just a little area. I'm going to have like a little, not bar again, just like a little lounge area up here. Not sure how I'm going to decorate it yet. I have a chef Lara I think I could put here, which was the goal. Chef Lara. Yes. Just so that looks more complete. I do want it further over. Chef Lara. Yeah. So yeah, not sure for 100% what we're going to do up here. Then you come down this way and to the left is going to be the campsite. So I built this up. Barathrum, thank you so much for subscribing. So here's the campsite. We don't have this cliff behind it built up yet, but it's going to have little like palm trees and stuff up there, I'm assuming. And we have a nice little area to sit. I love especially the lead up to the campsite. So you've got this alternating bamboo and coconut tree set up. Very cute in my opinion. Then over this way to the left leads into, first of all, this little flamingo sanctuary. Just a little pond. This area isn't totally done as you can see. That's like the extent of the campsite build. And then up here is the first neighborhood with a little sunken forest. So we've got this sunken forest, Bella, thank you for subscribing. And then Bengal's house and Goose's house. I think it's Goose. And then back here leads to the secret beach. I wanted it to actually have like a secretive vibe. So ka -chow, secret beach. And that is what we've built so far on the island. I'm proud of it so far, I think it's cute. We can head over this way. And so far, I think everything is super accessible too. I guess I didn't showcase resident services. I did build around resident services too. So down this way, Denny, thank you for subscribing. Down this way leads to resident services, which I started building. Just gave it some hedges behind the simple panels back there. And then I'm really proud of this area leading to the beach. This is such a small area, but I think it's decorated so fully and carefully. And I really, I am proud of the job I did with this. So yeah, that is the build we have so far. I'm not sure where my final house location is gonna be, Roni. No, get down, thank you. Um, not sure where my final house location is gonna be. Oh, I forgot my very first build on the island is the entrance. So over here, that black rose is not part of the build. I just keep meaning to take that to Nightshade Roni. New challenge, take a sip of water every time Roni jumps on my desk. It's been like 14 times so far. I don't think so, buddy. No. Hold on, I'm layering things so he can't jump up here. Okay. Anyway, this is the entrance to the island. So it says welcome and yeah has like a cute little area to sit and read a book, you know, essential for a Lex Play Island. And yeah, that is Lotus Reef so far. ka -chow. Sora, hello. I keep, I was looking at chat. That's why I kept running into walls. Lex is Holly blind. 
Did I miss a message from Holly? That's funny because I was showing my island to Holly who asked. Holly. Oh my gosh, Roni just jumped up on my back to get on my desk. Roni, you and I are about to fight for real. Okay. Anyway. He wants more attention the longer my streams go on, to be honest. I need to get like a cat cam so you all can see his little menace behavior. Roni is totally testing you right now. He's about to lose it. I don't know what, but something. Let me put a custom design here to kind of fill this space in. And then we just need to figure out what to do with this upper area for Nook's Cranny. Here I'll just have another little circle of custom design. Display, display. And then you already know what's going here. The Lex play. Oh my gosh, Ronald. Hold on. I've got to. I'll be right back. I've got to go put my drink away so he can't knock it over. Hello, hello, testing. Okay. For some reason, I have a drink in a plastic cup on my desk, and for some reason, Roni just cannot leave that alone. Okay. Wow, what a doozy this is. I have no idea what to do over here. This is, like, such a small area. And I'm also like, is there going to be a reason to go up to this cliff? I don't know yet. Let me see how big this cliff is. <laughs> Ronald. He's not in trouble. He's just being a little a nuisance, if you will. I could extend this cliff more over here, because there's not really anything going on over here besides access to the secret beach. Rune? Welcome. Thank you for subscribing. Anyway, that is to say I could add another incline leading up here and have something in the back. Potentially even Able Sisters. I got Chops as my campsite. I don't want to restart, but Chops, you know? I don't want to restart, but you could always... Whatchamacallit? Um, move them out later. So if we were to do another incline, I reckon it would go over here. Sorry, I'm thinking, pondering. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna extend the cliff over here so that there's room. Ooh, I could have a sunken waterfall if I do this. Let me build this up. Amanda, hello, welcome in. We are working on the Nook's Cranny area on Lotus Reef right now. So I am extending the cliff beside it. This is the second cliff level. So that I can potentially put Able Sisters in for next stream. I'm just assuming I won't have time this stream to like decorate an Able Sisters area. I'd rather have like a full stream, I think, to dedicate to that. 
And then I was thinking that I could potentially do a sort of sunken waterfall scenario over here. Maybe. Honestly, yeah, let me just focus on the edges because then I could build out if I leave some areas open here. I'm gonna leave this block open so that I can climb down and turn this into a sunken waterfall. At some point in the future. Okay, I just barricaded myself in. Thank you, Lex. Thank you, Lex. Lex, look at Holly's older messages. I don't know if it was because they sent the same message multiple times, but it does not show up for me. Spam gets blocked for me. Holly, feel free to ask again if you had a specific question. But I did not see anything. I'm gonna go take a nap. Okay, thank you so much for hanging out, Sel, and I hope you have a great day and a great nap. Roni still jumped on- I'm not kidding, he still jumped on my desk. There's not even anything over here for you, King. See, don't you feel silly? Now you jumped up here for nothing. Oh, I'm gonna lose it, Roni. Off of my desk. It really gets me that cats just, like, never learn. Like, he does this every day, and I put him off of the desk. And yet tomorrow, he will jump on the desk again. Not even in a few minutes, he'll jump on the desk again. Okay, so yeah, there will be space here for a sunken waterfall. Sunken waterfalls, then sunken forest, now sunken. Lex, you're right, Abby, that was me. Okay, should I restart as I had chops? I already answered that. I said I wouldn't restart. I would just try to move him out later. Okay. And also, like, if you restarted, what if you just got another, like, you probably wouldn't get chops again, but what if you got another villager you really didn't like? I don't think it's worth it to restart for that. I don't know what I want to do for the end. Okay, that's for next stream. I've just got to figure out something over here for now. I'm thinking just some classic little bushes here. Pink plumeria, maybe some plants. Because I don't know if I want the uh, incline up to Able Sisters. I've really committed in my mind. Up there is going to be Able Sisters. Just so the shops are together. And also because I did say this was a shopping district build. Sorry, getting Roni off my desk. I might have to go soon because clearly my cat needs my attention. Um, but yeah, so anyway, I don't know if the incline I want to be vertical. So like facing this way or horizontal facing this way. So then I'd take down the cliffs here. I guess it would be like easier to come up and then keep running. I guess I'll do that. Let me go ahead and mark this area off for an incline. I wonder if I can leave that bush there. Or I could go one more back, I guess. I'll try to just put the incline there. I'm not gonna place it yet because what if I need to fix something? But I'm gonna mark this area out. This is gonna be an incline. What do you guys think for my 70s themed island? It's called Groovacious. That's funny. All righty. And no worries, Holly. Do you have any 
the princess of wales that's um isn't that kate was she on bbc what did she say isn't there like a whole thing online right now about how she's like missing or whatever as an american i do not know anything about british politics or the royal family but i have heard that Kind of a testament to how intense it is, I guess. I'm gonna plant a Cosmo. I always forget I have those. And then another bush here, a pink one. And then I'm thinking of doing another little double fence situation because I just feel like that's trusty. Lex, I mean, I just said Lex. Hello, that's me. Jay, hello. Welcome in, glad you could make it to the stream. We are hanging out. We are just building away. I am, as chat has mentioned, at 100% today. I'm performing at 100%. Things are going really well for some reason. Is this a full area? Could I build here? I mean, plant. I'd like something to go here, but I don't know what... A vine bench could be cute. Hello. There is plenty of room. Yeah, cute. And we'll have an incline here. Things are really looking great. All right, so that is our Nook's Cranny build, I think. I think I've got to call it there because there is plenty of decor. I think I want a green leaf pile here, though. Not that far over, please. The green leaf piles, in my opinion, are one of the most annoying things to place just because it's so hard to get them in the right place and you can't push them. Yeah, cute. Just to, like, add something to see here. I'd kind of like an item here, maybe. I don't know. Let's time travel and see how it looks. And then I can update the dream address. Because that is all the designing we're going to be doing today. We'll go forward like a few days. Maybe 5 p.m. Nope. Maybe we'll get lucky and Bangle will be moving out. Oh, Abby, I hope you have a great day. Good luck with everything. How many times do you need to invite an amiibo? Three times? Yes. You have to invite them three days in a row and make whatever gifts they request. Well, not gifts, souvenirs. The villagers I like keep asking to move and not the ones I don't want. I should have villager hunted more when I had the chance. Yeah, I feel like it is difficult once a villager moves in. They just don't want to go. I can't remember who the last villager to move into my island was. I hope it wasn't Bengal because in that case she won't, me she won't leave. <laughs> Three times but each time you have to make them something. Correct, correct. Oh, wait, we're only five likes away from 200. Can we hit that? As I'm sitting here, like, fixing the dream address up. I wasn't paying attention. I hope it's not raining. I don't think it is. None of these villagers are moving out. Look at Piper. What a cutie. Okay. Let's go and see this little area here at sunset-ish. Yeah. 
Yeah, look at all the bushes growing now. It's so vibrant. Oh, one of these needs to be pink, I fear. We'll fix that later. Look at how cute. And then up here will be Able Sisters. So you'll come to the shopping district and have plenty to see and do. I don't think I've ever created such a small space for Nook's Cranny. Like this is very small. And thank you all for 200 likes on stream today. I appreciate that, besties. Thank you all so much. I'm loving this area though. I think it looks really nice here at the end of the afternoon. Kind of lazy vibes. I love this area so much. The little beach rock is so cute. But yeah, so this is what we worked on today. I'll probably include this cliff in this area in the peninsula build, so that'll probably be next week or a couple weeks from now, depending on how long the Able Sisters build takes. And then we can finish this too, and then the like top right of the island will be totally done. I think we're making pretty good progress on this side of the island. I'm so happy with this little Nook's Cranny build. Okay, let me update the dream address for you all. And then I've got to figure out if I can get Bangle to leave today for Ava. Look at Goose, he's wearing a Lotus Reef shirt that Ani M made, one of my channel members. How cute. All right, let me update. Sid, thank you so much. I was stuck with Piper not thinking about moving out. Not Piper. Piper is so cute. I already have an open plot. Okay, let me get a, let me see. I'll look after stream um, and get an amiibo card for a villager I want. I'm thinking June. What do you guys think about that? June as a replacement villager? I could also get rid of Blue Bear. So then June is the only cub and then I'd have room for another one because I really want Flora as well. I don't want to move Flora into Bengal's plot though because Bengal is, um, she's like already set. June could live there. I don't want, I want Flora to have her own spot. Like if I get Flora, I want her to have a specific, like very pink area, so. Does that make sense? Oh wait, no, I just accidentally said I wanted to visit a dream. About my island's dream, please. Roni, get off my desk. Oh, did you hear that? Okay. <laughs> I can hear my roommate laughing, stop. Roni is being a nuisance, bro. <laughs> okay, let me update the stream. <laughs> Stop laughing. <laughs> this is rough, guys. This is rough. I just got June. Love her. I do want her. I do want her. Carrot cake! You are going to be so disappointed to learn that we're almost at the end of stream. What did he do that was loud? He um jumped off my desk, except I think he kicked everything that was on the dress on the desk as he went. So he like knocked everything on my desk over, but it's fine. It's not a big deal. Here is the dream address for any of you that want to visit. Roni, that was rude. I'll let him know. I'll scream directly into his ear at some point today in order to in order to teach him that lesson. I'm just kidding. Cats don't understand punitive measures, by the way. Never punish your cat. I want a couple of the duck villagers because they're so cute. I have Pom Pom and I love her. Anyway, yeah, there is the dream address. I hope you all will enjoy visiting if you'd like to. Roni says he needs attention. Now he got it, bro. He got it. Carrot Cake, it's good to see you too. I feel like it has been a while. I didn't restart, by the way. I kept the island with chops. Good for you, Holly. I hope you're able to get him to leave soon. He's a mess. He is. Hold on. Hold on. I'll show a picture of him so you all can forgive him. Here's Roni. 
Here's Roni, my little baby. That's the guy kicking things over on my desk. He's just a cat. Here's another, here's another. Look at him. He's just sleepy boy. He's just a little, he's just a little menace. That's okay. Okay, anyway. That is all from me today, I guess, you guys. Everyone say goodbye, Lex. Goodbye, pineapple hat for today. Oh my gosh, I forgot you could zoom in so far inside. Can I get... There we go. Thank you all for the new membership today. I hope you have a lovely week. I will see you next Friday for another stream here on Lotus Reef. Probably Able Sisters. I'm going to have to check your list of custom designs for that plant you placed under the fence. Very cute. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. He has little mittens. He does. Innocent of all charges. Exactly. You guys didn't have to endure that loudness. It was just, it was all in your minds. <clears throat> bye guys. Bye Tato. Bye Amelia. Bye Stephanie. Eclipse. Goodbye Elena. Chrissy. Thank you for lurking. I hope you all enjoyed today. I really do feel like I was at the top of my design game for once. So I'll see you all next week and let's hope for another good stream. Bye. Thank you.